can record that. Uh, okay, London Punk are one of my first, first people who ever came to my live show here on Ustream. Um, he was my, my first person. He, he just, just, just th threw down a, uh, a thing here now. Says, that, hey, Walt, when I sight read, should I scan over the piece of music before I play it, or should I just uh, just start and then get as far in terms of writing it or reading the piece of music as I can before I get lost? And that the, ans and that the answer to that is do both. Take the extra second, scan over the piece of music, okay? It's just like, like anything. Before you get your feet wet, right, or well, before you jump into the pool, get your feet wet a little bit, right? So open up the book, read through it real quick, five or ten minutes before your gig or whatever, get used to the piece of sheet music, and then, um, you know, when, when you go to play, then you take it as far as you can, okay? And try not to get lost. I mean, you, I mean, you generally won't get lost, you know what I mean? So that's the idea, is that take a minute, read over it, and then take it as far as you can, because that's the type of person you are, right? Remember that. Okay, you fight for it as far as you can take it, and then when you think it's been a lot, close up the book, call it the day, and then rock out again tomorrow. So, that's my advice, and the other piece of advice is do it every single day. Don't just learn how to, how to read music once a week, because then you'll never learn it, okay? Review it for a couple minutes every day, then go and practice it for 15 or 20 minutes every day, and then, and it's the same with everything. It's the same with ear training. It's the same with sight reading. It's the same with learning how to play your chords. It's the same with, uh, you know, trying to be a basketball ball player or whatever it is. That's how you do it, okay? Um, it's all about the before, the preparation, and the doing, which is learning it. And then after you learn it, then it's about applying it and then teaching it to someone. And that's how you do it. So that's what I recommend.